there were two men at Oxford, Dr. Gilbert West and Lord George Littleton, who was a statesman. They were determined to destroy the basis of the Christian faith. They were upset at what these crazy things Christians were believing. So they decided to write a book together. <clears throat> and they were going to go their own individual way, do the research, come back, compare the research, and then write a book to refute Christianity. Gilbert West was going to demonstrate the fallacy of the resurrection. Lord Littleton was going to prove that Saul of Tarsus never converted to Christianity. Uh, I have several chapters on Paul. I think one of the greatest testimonies of the truth of Christianity is the conversion of Saul of Tarsus to the Apostle Paul. It's incredible, the historical background there and what happened. <clears throat> so they went their own way, and when they returned, each one was a little hesitant to share with the other. Why? Both of them had come to the exact opposite conclusion, what they set out to prove, and had become followers of Christ. And Gilbert West concluded, the resurrection was true. And, Gilbert, and Lord Littleton, the conversion and apostleship of St. Paul alone, duly considered, was of itself a demonstration sufficient to prove Christianity to be a divine revelation. 